Hello everyone, my name is Andre McLennan. Today I'm going to talk about how to run your code once per candle. Let's begin. First off guys, open up your trade terminal and go to MetaQuotes. It's in the top left hand corner right here. Or press F4. And what you guys want to do is, you have a window pop up like this. All you got to do is hit New. We're going to create an Expert Advisor. And next, we're going to call it one once per candle now with this code guys I found two ways to do it the way that I typically do it, and then this popular way I think another youtuber has uh, brought it up but I found another way that other people do it and let's do Google so both ways work uh, I'm gonna go over their way first before going over mine and this will be basically creating this as a function so first off guys let's get the code out and this is how it's actually written and I thought it was pretty impressive way it's uh, being done now it's called bull is a new candle so basically if you guys do not know what a bull is bull basically means true or false okay and it's gonna read is the result of this function is new candle true or false basically we're gonna do a static now a static is gonna be if you guys do not know you just go to meta quotes right here you can read right here the storage class of defines a static variable. So basically it's gonna take the variable of the date time of save candle time, and we're gonna keep it at that value, which we put typically zero of a current on uh, current. If time of zero, so if you guys do not know a time, just hit uh, selected, hit F1. You guys can get some medical data. Uh, sorry, the meta quotes reference. This is a series array that contains open time of each bar. So we got the open time of each bar, which is a up zero, so the current, equals equals, so it's gonna verify check if they equal, which they will for a brief time for the open. Now, if if it's true, return false, if this goes through, it's gonna return false. And if else, uh, save current time equals time, uh, save candle equals time zero. So they will equal a brief time, and then return true value because once that equals is going to run the at, run it as a static time so it will equal once and then return true now if we run this code real quick you'll see that there's no errors it'll run the code once per candle now here's the other way of running the once or one time per candle okay and this is the way that i typically do it and if you guys want to use it my way or the other way go ahead it's up to you there you go. So for me, I would just do an if statement. You guys can do an on tick. And basically what it'll do is that if time zero, basically the open price of the current count equals the to current time, which you will for a brief second for like one tick, comment just once. So basically I'm just showing you guys in the top left hand corner that it's going to run this comment once per candle and the else is going to be everything else. And if you guys want to see it in a print statement, it's the same thing. So if you guys want to see how it looks over here, it basically is a new candle plus. So it's going to run it every once new candle. Let's try uh, both for the first time, okay? So let's get rid of this real quick. All right, compile. So you guys, what you guys want to do when is go to uh, your strategy tester, go to the whatever you named your file. Call this one first candle. We're gonna use visual mode. We're gonna do it on the five minute and we're gonna make sure we press pause prior to running. So if you guys see in the top left hand corner, you'll see that the code will be running once per candle. See, it's true, but if you run it really, really slowly, you'll see that it'll be true, false, true, false, see? And every time at the open of a candle or the beginning of a candle, it just hit true. So you guys can use this for checking your code once per candle or running some type of script or whatever once per candle. And I hope this helps out, guys. I, pro I program in two different ways. Uh, both ways work. All you gotta do is this, uh, you, you look at the video, you can copy the code. But it will be on my website, so you guys can check that out. And also, if you do this right here, zip this out. 
the same thing will be will pop up. So when we hit stop, hit start again, and same thing. So very easy code, guys. Uh, once again, check out my uh, MQL4 uh, playlist, or even check it on my website. See, every time a new candle comes up, it just says uh, one time or something like that. But yeah, guys, very easy stuff. I hope this helps out with you. But uh, please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video.